That well, some shoppers on Buffalo's east side have a new grocery store in an area of the city which some have labeled a food desert. Our Alexandra Rios Malvia has more tonight about what this means for that neighborhood. Alex. Dave, for residents of this neighborhood where there's already an Aldi supermarket, this gives them a second option like many other parts of Western New York have. Fresh, affordable and quality food without having to travel too far to get it. Everyone needs to have access to good, clean, affordable food. Not only does the Upon supermarket have these products, there's also a variety of them. Families can cook meals, they can clean their houses, they can live healthy and sustainable lives. Three, two, one. Buffalo community members and politicians call this an historic moment for the Broadway Bailey community for Buffalo's east side. This is a diverse community. Look around you. Look at the faces. Look at the smiles. Look how hungry we are. We've been waiting on a supermarket. We've been praying on a supermarket. Thank you, everyone. Mohammed Ismail, who is one of the six owners, has been trying to tackle this issue for quite some time now. After the December blizzard, this area took a really hard hit when stores like Family Dollar and Dollar Tree were taken off the market. Mohammed took this as an opportunity. And, uh, there was a dream to open a store around here to build, you know, help the community build, build the Buffalo East Side Buffalo boom again. So that's what it is. This is 14,000 square feet. It will not only serve his neighborhood, but surrounding ones where before Mohammed had to travel far to get the things that he needed. That's why we are here. They don't need to drive around, drive far to get their groceries or anything. They just walk and come here and we'll have a fresh fruits, veggies, all kind of stuff here daily, daily, every day. It's also important for Mohammed to employ people from the neighborhood. Very important. You know, you got to you, you gotta support the community. It's an extreme progress. Fillmore District Council member Mitch Nowakowski, who represents his neighborhood, agrees. He says this is a signal of progress for Buffalo's no, east side. We shouldn't just, just take what we can get. We should demand more. We should ask for quality services, but also quality products in our own neighborhood. Having a second supermarket in the neighborhood not only gives them more choices, but also breeds competition, which also can mean lower prices. On your side of the newsroom, I'm Alexandra Reels Malvia, Channel 2 News.